Kung kami, parang, oh my God, is the whole Philippines underwater? Like, is this the end of our lives? Nasa tayo. I needed help. Like, there might be a shark. Oh, see? <laughs> Hi, Pabsters! I'm Jean P. I'm Rachel. And welcome dito sa bago nating paandar on YouTube and Facebook ang tinatawag nating Tep Exclusives. Makakasama natin ngayon ang bagong host sa TV5, Chica Besh. Walang iba kundi si Ria Tayde! Hello. Hi, Ria! Hello, guys! Hi, Ria! Nice! Welcome to PEP Exclusive. Thank you for having uh, me. And so, congratulations. Oh, thank you so much. Ah. So, I appreciate it. Malaking tulong din. Hello. You know, naman, times are like this. Kailangan ng help. Anyway. Ayun. So, syempre, um, meron kang bagong-bagong project ngayon with TV5. Siguro, can you take us back to that moment nung first time mong marinig na may offer na you'll be one of the hosts for Chica Besh. Okay. Um, the moment itself, I was doing therapy and my handler texted me that I was requested by TV5 for a show to host with Mamang and Pauline. Sabi niya, I need your decision soon. Are you okay? Sabi ko, wait, tita, at least give me like a day, a day and a half to figure this out. Like, meditate on it, figure it out. Kasi parang, given the circumstance, parang kakaano lang din nung, kakashutdown lang ng network na, namin nun eh, diba? So, parang, wait a moment, this is like, wait, wait. So, after that, of course, I was grateful. Kasi, diba, that's such a, I mean, to be able to host a talk show is such a big deal. And it's not in, exactly something na I'm known for. It's, I mean, you know, I'm more acting talaga, and this is super new to me. So I'm grateful that I was even given a chance to explore. Yung parang, you know, when people see things in you that you don't see in yourself, parang ganon. Yung parang, oh, okay, maybe I can do it. And then from there, it just became a step-by-step thing. I talked to my parents about it. I talked to my friends about it. Then I talked to so the, our bosses about it to see what they thought about it. And when I saw that everybody was okay with it and that they were supportive about it, including the bosses of ABS, I was like, okay, then maybe it's okay that I do this. This is not betrayal of my network. It's nothing, it's an opportunity and amidst a pandemic, that's not something you say no to. Blessings, di ba? Right. Yeah, so. Kasi yun yung mga initial, lalo na this was like announced in July. Or July, tama no? Yung July, uh, na meron ang mga um, magkakaroon ng bagong show sa TV5. And I think, yun nga, hindi may iwasan na magkaroon ng um, surprise din yung iba kasi syempre inaabangan nila na ay may mga galing sa ABS-CBN appearing in TV5. Pero in fairness, yun nga, klaro na may bas-bas ng mga mat ng ABS-CBN. Sinigurado ko talaga. I feel like I personally, given how affected I am by the shutdown and um given how angry I still am about it because, you know, it's, to me, it's still an injustice. Uh, parang, I had to make sure that all of that was okay. Kasi ayoko ng conflict and I don't wanna seem like a hypocrite. I don't wanna seem like I'm abandoning ship because, in fact, I'm not. If anything, I'm glad this gives me a platform because at least this way, kahit wala yung network ko, I'm still able to voice out my concerns and opinions, di ba? Pero parang ano ba, hindi kasi sabi mo, di ba, bagong-bago sa'yo. So, nakita mo na ba ang sarili mo talaga na sometimes, someday, magiging host ka? Well, now that I've started, I can see myself in it. Although, ang dami ko pang kailangan i-improve. As in, when I watch myself, I'm always like, Tal- talaga ba? Ser- seryoso ka ba? Yun na yun? And parang, I guess I'm still in that, I'm still trying to figure out how I am as a host. Alam mo yun? Yung ang dami ko, this is so new, legit so new to me. And the talk show is so different from hosting an event, I feel. And the talk show is so different from hosting Cinema News 1. Alam mo yun? Yeah. 
Pero okay naman. Now I can see, ha? Huh? Dati na ganoon ka na, yung asiniman. Ay, yeah. Oo, oh, oo. Oh, oh. When si Ate Bianca is unavailable, I'd be tapped for it. Ah. So yeah. at least, meron naman din palang ano, background ng hosting din. Hindi naman Mer- totally. I mean, Pero syempre, would... iba nga naman. Yung iba, oo. Oh, oh. Iba kasi. Iba yung pagbasa ng spills as opposed to an actual conversation with somebody. You know, how do you converse with somebody who is your guest na, alam mo yun, kasi pag nagkiktuhan tayo, hindi mo maiwasan, uy, alam mo, ako rin, ganyan, di ba? Uh-huh. Di ba? Parang may mga tao, ganda. eh, ganun ako as a person eh. It's not because I wanna, na, nagbibida ako ng sarili ko or whatever, pero I find, ako personally, pag ginaganon kasi ako na, uy, alam mo, ako rin, ganyan. Uh, I find na, I it makes me realize na I have things in common with people. Right. Yun. So, yun, yun eh. And how do you, if that's how I'm used to talking, how do I change that for a talk show, di ba? Ang dami, ang dami palang iniisip pag talk show. Even the fluidity of the conversation comes into play. Kahit na may questions kayo, you still have to think about how do you make an interview seem natural even if you have guide questions. Di ba? Parang ang hirap na eh. But, okay. So yeah, that's what that's what I'm learning now, and I'm glad that Pauline and Mamang are the ones with me, because hindi na lang ako pinapabayaan. Chaka hindi sila yung uh, hindi sila yung may seniority complex, because I mean they both hosted before, although bago lang din yung talk show sa kanila. Um, sila yung mas may experience sa hosting, so pag ganon, kahit sa spiel sa sabi ng Ria, ikaw na Ria kaya mo yan, nak kaya mo yan, ganon. You know what I mean? It's it's nice to have people who encourage you working uh-huh. with you. Oh, Walang sobrang sa kanila. Ganyan. Sobrang wala. Ang ano lang, ano, spoiling each other if anything. Grabe kami magpakain sa isa't isa. Hindi naman dahil feeling namin kailangan namin gawin. Pero, ganun yata talaga kami. Yung language of love like, namin tatlo. Uh-huh. And, wala. I'm just, I'm happy it's them talaga. Ano mga pagkain yan? Ng mga Ay, oh my God! God. Si Mamang, of course, her pokely proje- pro- products, laing, tuyo, tinapa. Oh my God. Tapos si Mamang nagluto ng suwang. First time kong uh-huh. matry. Oh my gosh. Tapos si ate po. Cookies. Ang sarap. Mahili kasi ako sa cookies. As in, I legit Tara. have a cookie every day. So alam mo yun, yung parati kami nag-exchange gift, ganyan, nakakatawa. Yeah, it's fun. I'm enjoying myself. Pero ang galing, no? Kasi first time mong makatrabaho din si Poki kahit na galing din siyang ABS-CBN, di ba? So, paano mm-hmm. yung chemistry ninyo? Parang buti na bond kayo agad kahit na mm-hmm. magkakaiba kayo ng pinanggalingan ng mga ano. Yeah. So, Actually, ako, ako rin medyo nagtataka eh. Bakit parang instant yung pag-uusap namin, naging comfortable kami sa isa't isa. And then yesterday, parang may interview kami kay uh, Nay Christy. Tapos na-bring up ni Ate Poleng na parang uh, lahat kami may connection sa isa't isa already in the past. Which is true. Si Mamang and I were in ABS together and she's close to my mom. Nag-uusap sila parate kasi Bisaya, ganyan, nagluluto, ganon. And then, si Mamang, pag nakikita ko, we converse naman, very, very light conversations before. Si Ate Pauling naman is very close to my mom because they worked together before in GMA. Uh, so, yeah. parang, uh, may, tas si Mamang and si Bossing work together in movies, di ba? Ang daming movies ni Bossing na nandun si Mamang. So, parang meron na kaming connection to begin with. And then, siguro, dagdag effort din kasi nung uh, pictorial namin na buong araw kaming magkakasama and we made it a point to really open up to each other. As in, yung parang I found myself sharing things na hindi ko naman sinishare usually sa mga taong nasa showbiz din na, alam mo yung first time you get to hang out. Ito kasi parang sila, they were just so open and yun, it made me comfortable knowing na, okay, so I feel like we do trust each other already. And yun, collaborative effort lang talaga on the show din. Tapos, sa'yo naman, parang dahil gano'n na yung chemistry nyo, di ba? 
si Sophie Andes ang una niyong guest. Oo. Oh, oh. Parang nakatulong din ba sa'yo yun? Kasi parang mas naging natural yung, ano, yung flow ng conversation dahil lahat kayo magkakakilala, lalo na ikaw. Parang ikaw yung pinakamalapit kay Sophia, di ba? Habang mm-hmm. si Pauline at saka si Popong, sila yung parang mas on the motherly side, ganun. Mm-hmm. Um, sobrang laking tulong actually na si Soph. And I was so surprised. And I'm glad it was her because it was her first sit-down interview since her announcement of her baby and from the start kasi I was really supportive of her with it. So seeing her, I mean, people don't know na we're close eh. Di, di naman kami ma-post about each other and all of that. So close pala kayo ni Ria, ni Ria, ni Sophia, Sophia in real life. Oo, oh, oo. Oh, oh. So you knew so, about her pregnancy kayo. before? Oh yeah. Friend eh, alam mo yun? Mm-mm. And these are things na my God, like, if it's that big of ni- a, ni- a piece of news, diba? Ibig sabihin nun, you are, you matter to that person for them to share something so intimate like that to you. So I value that and I think it really helped me na siya yung unang interview, as awkward as I was pa rin. Like, I still, sobrang awkward ka nun. And then some episodes, I get drowned out kasi I keep la, bungis-ngis kasi akong tao eh. So minsan tatawa lang ako ng tatawa. Tapos sabi ko, kayo na, kayo na. Ano mo yun? Yung hindi ko na kaya. Kasi tatawa lang ako. Pero yeah. Okay, pero yun nga, nung siguro nung una, medyo, kung, medyo nangangapapa ng konti. Pero dahil nga siguro si Sophia yun, nung Q&A na, parang dun na mas naging um, organic yung Stop flow. Oo. Oh, oh. Yung ano na yun, interview. Kasi na ba yung maaabangan nating guests na parang na ano ka rin talaga na may ma- siguro sa hosting style mo din may na-discover ka ganyan. Sino ba pin- So far kasi enjoy naman ako sa lahat ng interviews namin. Hmm. We've had Miss Lani, Miss Lucia, Regine Tolentino, uh, si Cupcake, he guested all. So, and actually, ang dami na naming episode na na-shoot din kasi given our situation, di ba, di natin alam baka bigla tayo pumalik ng ECQ. So, sobrang nagbabangko kami. Um, marami, maraming guests. And in terms of hosting, I'm still, ang dami kong kailangan trabahuin pa talaga. Even the tone of which I speak. Um, and although what I like is they've encouraged me to be myself. So, hindi na kailangan pilitin yung pagtatagalog, which I am so grateful for. Because as much as I love the language, Meron talaga akong, meron kaming struggle with each other. Considering kasi I grew up speaking English eh. Okay. Spanish-Filipino family. Alam mo yun? Mm-hmm. Pero, yeah, so siguro I wanna work on my Tagalog. I wanna work on my rhythm pa rin as a host. Uh, ad-libbing, alam mo yun? Ang dami, dami pa. My God. Di ba, like, at, at least yun nga, very self-aware ka naman. At the same time, madami pa, um yung, alam mo, yung room for improvement mo. And kahit na ganun nga, eh, sobrang nakatulong talaga na nag-gel kayo eh, tatlo. Kahit mm-hmm. na, kung mag- makikita mo naman sa speech ka, parang natural. Yung chika-chika na parang magkakaibigan. Ganyan. Actually, alam mo, walang episode na hindi kami tumatawa. As in, tawa lang kami ng tawa na minsan, parang naawa na kami sa editor. Sabi, joke nga na ni Mamang na ang pinakamalaking regalo for Christmas, mapupunta sa editor namin. Kasi seryoso, yung mga body namin, umaabot ng, kunwari, ang target is 15 minutes. We reach like 25, 30, oh per body. Per ah. body. Alam mo, per body. Kawawa yung, ano, kawawa yung editor. Tapos a lot of it is just laughing. At nahihirapan din daw sila when they cut, di ba? Pag, kunwari, wide tapos tighter. Minsan kasi hindi simul yung pag-shoot. Nahihirapan sila makahanap ng cutting point. Kasi minsan, yung upo namin yung, ha ha! ha! <laughs> yung, yung, yung parang, oh my God, umayos. Umayos naman tayo ng very light. Kailangan namin ipaalala sa isa't isa na, oy, teka lang, trabaho muna tayo, guys. <laughs> May dream ka na top three na gusto mong i-get yeah. sa show. Hala? Oh my God, that's a very good question. You know, so far, I feel like, of course, my friends. Siguro my friends. We, I've, I've, we've had Marco Gumabo on the show, so who would that? 
Well, sino ba? Alam mo, hindi ko alam. Mahirap sagutin kasi ang dami kong friend na gusto kong ipag-guest. Alam mo yun, yung saya siguro kung siya yung guest. Ang dami! Ang dami. Um, siguro, of course, may barkada. Si Lakat. Uh, may si chance, Papadon, no? May... Oh, sila. May whole group. Cute siguro. Gabby, <laughs> Garcia, Khalil, Dom Roque, Pat Sugi, Joe Vargas, yung mga yun. Gege. Oh my God. I think kasi more than appearing sa show, the concern is really going out. Because we yeah. shoot live, eh. Hindi uh-huh. naman kami via Zoom, eh. So parang, given the circumstance, then ang daming medyo takot pa lumabas. Medyo, ay parang, hindi naman kailangan pa mag-guest. So wag na lang muna kasi I'd rather be safe, alam mo yun. Although we do follow super... We super like strictly adhere to the safety precautions na guidelines and all of that. I guess iba pa rin kasi yung for others. So yun. I think that's really more the concern than the networks. It's really this pandemic. Pero ikaw this pala. Ferry sa yo na lumabas. Ah. Uh, kasi ano kami, medyo planning din ako. So nagpapaswab ako once a month. Oh. Rapid test. Oh, well, we rapid test every two weeks per work talaga. Pero personally, swab test then once a month. For my sanity and for... Kasi, honestly, this with the, with this virus, means and though kasi, I've read so many articles na you can start manifesting symptoms by thinking that you have it. Diba? Yung mind over matter. Kahit na wala ka naman. So, Kasi medyo may ganong tendency ako eh. I mean, considering my parents also had it, diba? So medyo, yes. oh, wait lang. Onting, um, kunwari, aaching ako, oh no, oh no, ganun na agad. So, um, hindi ako natatakot because I am confident in the fact that I get tested. And I think apart from that, it's also a part of me dealing with my mental and emotional state na parang life goes on, you know? As hard as it has been for the past months, life goes on. We have to learn to adapt. And, ayun, as long as I know din naman kasi that the production is taking good care of us, okay na ako doon. Alam mo yung parang every after, ano, oy, mag-alcohol ka na agad, ina-alcohol na ako agad. And then everybody's naka-mask, naka-PPE. Sobrang safe, in fairness. Of course, you can't be too safe pa rin, pero ikampante naman ako with how the production is as well. Well, halata naman doon sa set nyo, yung grabe, hiwa-hiwalay nga kayo, di ba? Mismo! May, oh. Pati nga, my God, pati yung mga plug, hiwa-hiwalay din kami. Parang, oh my God, layo natin sa isa't isa. Pero oh, sige, oh. let's, okay lang to. For our safety then. I mean, mamang has a senior with her, she has a baby, at the polling also, so parang for everybody's safety lang doon. Mm-hmm. Tama naman. Okay. So ito, para medyo konting balikan lang natin yung kung paano nagsimula yung dream mo na maging artista. Sigo, pa, kailan mo na-realize na, ay, gusto ko rin pumasok sa showbiz? Okay. Mahaba-habang kwento yan. Kasi, nung bata daw ako, gusto ko. Gusto ko talaga umarte. Kaso, I guess, naging focused ako sa pagiging professional student. Ganon. Yung sobrang kinarear ko yung pag-aaral ko. Na, I, I, disregarded it completely in my head. Mm-hmm. And then when I got to college, kasi, so it wasn't part of the plan. Akala ko I'd go corporate. Akala ko I'd do PR or events. Akala ko yun yung line ko. And then when I graduated from college, umalis ako. I took like a few months out of the country. And then habang nandun ako, my mom called me. Tapos nagsabi siya, baka gusto mo mag-audition. Uh you know, not everybody's given the opportunity to audition. Uh, even, I mean, you know, even to audition is such a big deal, di ba? Na parang, consider it. Like, think about it. Kahit ayaw mo, hindi mo naman gusto, alam ko anong gusto mong gawin sa buhay mo. Nakabreak ka pa rin naman sa pagtatrabaho. Then, pag-isipan mo. And the only thing was, I had to leave earlier than I had initially intended to. So, umuwi ako mas maaga kasi parang napanaginipan ko. The night that my mom called me, I was on set and I was acting. And then oh. I came home, I auditioned. And then when I auditioned, parang, ano kasi ako, I'm the type of person that I'll say yes to everything, I'll try everything out. 
kahit once. Kunwari, at least nasabi kong mat- na-try ko. So, okay, sige. Let's audition. So, I got to audition, whatever. Okay ako. Then eventually, hindi na bigay sa akin yung role. So, I was like, okay, maybe it's not for me. And then, parang na-bring up na, no, why don't you consider taking workshops? Not because... Yeah, so I was like, you know what, why not? Even my, my, kasi back then, yung Tagalog ko, mas madala pa eh. Tagay Thai, Boracay, mga ganon. <laughs> ano ba yun? Yung, whoa, yes, Ria, ano. Um, pero yun, so uh, I worked on that, and then I did workshops. No nag-workshops ako, dun ko na-realize na, ah, okay. Ito pala yung, ah, okay. Okay pala to. Ah, okay. Alam mo yun, yung, when I was doing workshops, I, I found some sort of emotional, mental, spiritual fulfillment even physical actually kasi parang sa workshop di ba parang you get in touch with yung mga emotions or yung mga mm-hmm. pinagdaanan ganyan kaya din so nabuksan yeah. Yeah. Hindi, tapos aside from nabuksan parang nakita ko na parang ang sarap pa lang umarte mm-hmm. ang sarap pa lang to like you're able to become another person i i was i've become a lawyer I've become a doctor without having to take the bar. Alam mo yan, like, uh, uh, experience uh, ko kahit pa pan. I mean, role lang yun. Of course, it's not the same thing. Not at all. Iba pa rin yung totoong doktor, di ba? Pero, alam mo yan, yung parang kahit pa paano na-experience ko rin in terms of... Parang, kailangan mo kasing ipasok yung sarili mo sa character nila, di ba? So, lots of research, kanyan. And I, I love that. I love that we're able to do that. So yun na. Does it answer your question? Parang I can't yes, answer your question. Yes! Nayan lang to na pinag-auditionan mo na una. Oo, yun nga. Dream that. Dream that. Dream dream that. Dream that. Which is, I dream that. Dream that. Which, is, which is why my dear heart was so, parang I felt so full circle. Yeah. Then, kasi I was supposed to be with Zandro in Dream that. And then, so my dear heart, siya yung kasama ko. So sabi uh-huh. ko, ah, okay. So the universe prepared me for this one. Dito pala tayo magsasama. Alam mo yun? Hindi binigay yun kasi mas, oh, mas maganda din yung naging kinalabasan ng role ko doon. Anyway, uh-huh. that was such a great opportunity for me. To this day, it's one of my favorite roles ever. What is anyway. it, Jana, diba? Kasi sa Ning. Jana, oh. Jana Ning Ning. Oo, oh, oh, oh. mismo. Nakasama ko pa rin naman yung dalawa. Nakakatuwa. Sobrang nakakatuwa. Oh, yeah. Pero di ba before that, nag-try ka pa mag-PBB? Tama Ay, ka? talaga? Hindi, ganito yan. Okay, let's stop it. Dream na. Oh, lahat ng kwento ko may kwento, di ba? <laughs> yung namumunga yung kwento. Empress and I, Empress Shook, mm-hmm. we we grew up super close kasi. Um, and then, parati kami nag-joke before na parang, huy, mag-PBB kaya tayo. Tignan natin paano tayo doon. I was at artista pa nun. Then sabi ko sa kanya, oo gago. Tapos, ano lang, pag tinapan natin sila, kunwari ayaw natin sa isa't isa, manggulo tayo doon, ganun. And then, Empress moved to GMA, she had the baby, and then, the opportunity again, during the, after, I, had, I did workshops. That year, the whole year after. Dumating yung PBB 737 ba yun? Oo. 77. Si Kev, basta Kevin Balot, Kevin Balot yun, no? Kasi there. Basta, I know, Kevin Ballot also auditioned. Okay. Basta yun. Basta yun. BBB something. BBB something something. And then well, kasi... Well, that's when you're Ningning. That was before Ningning. Oo. 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 Oh, before Ningning. Parang ang sabi ko doon, I tried. Eh, kasi meron parang part doon na... I don't know if it's the same for every audition, but for that specific audition, there was a part where you had to pair up with somebody na di mo kilala. It just so happens I knew the person. Was that? Uh, let's not talk about it now. Pero um, I gave her the op. Parang you, the two of you would have to talk for about a couple of minutes, and then you decide who gets to stay and move on to the next round and who's gonna leave. Oh. May ganon. As I was saying, I know this person and I know her intentions for joining and for mm-hmm. even trying. Because yung brother niya is a good friend of mine. I know kasi her brother supports the entire family. Mm-hmm. So I knew for a fact that if she had gotten in and whatever opportunity comes, all of that is going to go to her family. Breadwinner. Eh ako naman, my mom grew up as a breadwinner. Laki akong breadwinner. So parang, who am I to take away the opportunity from someone 
Kung trip ko lang naman sumali at hindi, alam mo yun, yung trip ko lang sumali. Yes. Eh siya parang mas malaman yung dahilan niya at feel ko she deserved it more than me. So I made way kasi if I really wanted to get into showbiz, marami, I mean, it's it's gonna be a lot easier for me. I mean, let's get real. My mom is an actress. The fact right. that she's an actress already makes it, supposedly makes it easier for me, di ba? To get mm-hmm. in. So sabi ko, okay, sige, you know what? It's not for me. This is yours. So I left. And I gave her the slot. Oh. In fairness, may mga ganun din pala sa, minsan sa auditions pa lang. <laughs> Ang hirap. Oo. Oh, oh. oh, oh, oh. Pero okay naman. I mean, I feel like also if I did PBB, hindi ako mag acting workshop. I wouldn't have realized yeah. I like acting pala. I love it. Alam mo yun? Mm-hmm. Everything really has a reason talaga. Yeah. So, nabanggit mo na nga, no, na your um, mom is an actress and you also have a brother na who entered showbiz before you. Parang, do you feel like it's an advantage or more of a challenge na may kapamilya ka sa showbiz? I love this question because people, yung common misconception is madali eh, mas madali. But if anything, it makes it a little bit harder, I think. I mean, okay, everybody has a different set of struggles. Alam mo yun? It's, like, your struggle is not equal to my, like, if, what's heavy for me might not be heavy for you. Diba? Uh-oh. Um, ako kasi, it's, obviously, it's easier because, kunwari may audition, madali mong malalaman na may audition. Uh-oh. As opposed to looking for listings, asking people pa, asking around. Kami, parang, it becomes easier in that sense. But I think that's what people often forget. Like, not all roles are given. A majority of my roles, I've had to audition for. Yung mga hindi ko lang pinag-auditionan, yung mga MMK, ipaglaban mo, yung mga guesting, ganun. But for all the series that I did, I had, I've had to audition. Um, and I think why I say it's a little bit harder to come from a family of actors is because there is so much room for comparison. Yeah. Like, like even sa taping, kunwari, minsan may off day ako na hindi ako maka-arte ng maayos, na parang, I'll be like, sorry, direct ha, di ko mabigay, eh, ganyan. May mga sasagot na, sus, nanay mo naman si Ibiang. Yeah. It's meant to be encouraging. But yung register nun sa akin, becomes different in a way that, oh my God, my they friend. expect me to be like my mom. <laughs> they expect me to be as good as my brother, who is freaking brilliant and amazing at what he does. Na parang, wait lang, ha? Let me remind you, five years pa lang ako dito, kalma lang. Alam mo yun? Um, of course, I can't complain because being, coming from a family like mine, hindi naman ako, alam mo yun, parang there's also a sort of added... I don't want to say respect, eh, pero parang less pangingilala ng tao. Mm-hmm. Yung parang they're, they're afraid to offend me because they know my mom is my mom. So there's, okay. you know, there's there's pros and cons then, of course. Pero, yeah, I think people just often tend to forget na mahirap din. Yung, yung the pressure that comes with it and I think also mahirap in a sense na Ang hirap makafind ng line between work and the house. Kasi hanggang dito sa bahay, acting pa rin yung pinag-uusapan. <laughs> Mga showbiz pa rin. I mean, which is acting, like talking about acting is amazing. Yeah. But talking about showbiz things sometimes, I'm always like, oh my god, like, that's my work. Like, personal life, different. Alam mo yan? Uh-huh. Yeah. Ang dami ko sinabi, okay, sana okay lang yun. Oh naman. Pero sa, dahil nga dun sa experience mong yun, meron bang hurtful thing na tumatak sa'yo na nasasabi ng ibang tao na judgment about you, like being, part being of an actress, actress or being an actress or anything or any feedback. Ayun na naman. Madami. My goodness. Sobrang dami. Kasi Especially... parang mm, looking at you or yung mga even yung mga the way you handle stuff, parang very strong personality ka kasi parang you don't easily get offended. Okay. Or do you feel hurt? Still? Okay. There's a difference, I think, 
between okay let me rephrase that ako kasi it's always i feel like everything is a choice we take responsibility for like i i i'm so conscious about taking responsibility for my decisions for my actions for my reactions yes kasi i can't i can't change what people think i can't control what they say okay so what i usually do is can my hurtful thing na sasabihin okay sige Ah, okay, that's how they feel about me. Nah. Like, I have to choose not to eh. I have to choose to ignore it. Of course, <laughs> natatamaan ako. Of course, na-hurt ako minsan. But it's more like a conscious effort of like, okay, acknowledging that there is that. There are people that think like that of me. But instead of using it as something to drag me down, I changed my mindset into using it as something that would motivate me. Not because I have to prove anything to anyone. Never. We don't have to prove ourselves to anybody. And we don't have to apologize for emotions, ever. Okay. Pero yung parang just personally, yun yung mga conversations that I have with myself na, okay, first of all, this person doesn't completely matter to you. Why should they open, Why should their opinion affect you this much? Bakit kilala ka ba nila from when you grew up? You know what I mean? Do they know what you've been through as a person? Do they know how you're like at home? So, as long as it's constructive criticism, you and I take that in stride talaga. Pero yung pambabash na wala namang bear, alam mo yun, yung parang, uh-uh. yes? Seryoso ka ba? Anong point mo? Pag ganun, parang mas, yun, it's really pep-talking myself and being staying on top of my emotions. Yeah. It's yeah. a lot of work though. Mahirap. Yeah, for sure. Ang galing. Pero, pero, pag, pag, Dina, alam mo yun, parang, okay. I also get to use it for work eh. Yung parang ginagamit mong bubog, hindi ko muna iisipin. Dito ka lang. Dito ka lang. Tapos pag may eksenang hindi ako maka-get into character or whatever. Kasi sometimes that happens eh. We use different uh-huh. methods for every scene. Sometimes you do replacement. Sometimes you do use your own bubog. Sometimes you get into the character, diba? So pag nahihirapan ako with other methods, iisipin ko yung mga nakasakit sa akin. Pagkakakitaan ko sila. Alam mo yun? Yung itong luhang ko. Di ba? Pinagkakitaan oh. kita. Ganun. Kala mo ha? Ah. Best revenge naman yun. Very constructive. Mismo. <laughs> may hinahanap pa Kuwait kasi may pinost ka talaga sa Twitter na ang ganda-ganda na parang last year yun eh. Hindi ko nga makita eh. Pero parang may tungkol din dyan. Parang coach siya na parang yung hindi nga talaga nagmamatter yung mga sinasabi ng iba. So, parang kebs, hindi ka naman nila kilala. Parang ganun. Well, that sounds like yeah. something I would say. <laughs> <laughs> Kasi I just did. Eh. Alam mo. Hindi. Mm-hmm. Ano talaga, ako, as long as my friends, my family, and the people that matter to me know where I'm at and they're, they're supportive of me, okay ako dun. Ito, na, na ano, a year ago, August 1, 2019, everything you say can and will be taken against you. Dot, dot, dot. So just disregard them and live your truth. You don't leave, you don't live for their approval anyway. Oh, di ba? May mga pagandang si Ria at tayo, baby. Ano kaya ang hugot niyan, no? Oh, ano kaya ang hugot nun? Hindi, <laughs> <laughs> feeling ko ano yan, yung... Hindi ko pwedeng sabihin, eh. Kasi recorded pala to. <laughs> Hindi. Pero parang ano na? Matters. Parang ano? Bashers yun. Uh-oh. Bashers. Ah, gets. Ah, gets. So, ano, ang isa sa mga nakakatuwa, no, parang sobrang close kayo ni Arjo. Yung mga post niya, post mo, makikita talaga, I mean, si Arjo, very low-key yan, eh. Pero kapag ganating dun sa, yung mga, pagkababatiin ka niya sa social media, pero mga kayo all out pa, talaga si Arjo. Di, si Arjo is really, ano, ganyan yan pag, ano, when he feels strongly about something, he will talk. As a brother, parang sweet siya. Oo. Oh, 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 I mean, away-away din ba kayo ng baguette? Nung baguettes, of course. Mm, My God. Oo. Oh, oh. Parang away as in may... <laughs> physical minsan, or hindi ko minsan ka ba mga bata? Ay, grabe! Or more on, <laughs> ano lang, asaran. Ay, in, fa- in fairness naman, si Arjo, nangaasar lang talaga when we were growing up. <laughs> hindi siya titigil hanggang hindi ako umiiyak. <laughs> so, in turn, ang ginagawa ko, kinakagad ko siya hanggang dumugo siya, ganun. <laughs> Napadugo mo talaga? Oo. Oh, oh, o pala! Ganun. 
or sobrang sumbong, alam mo yun. But eventually, kasi nung tumanda kami, parang nawala na dahat ng yun. And then, ang dami kasi namin ginawa together. Football, figure skating, um, ang dami, dancing, ang dami namin activities together na parang we realized na as much as we get on each other's nerves because we don't agree on what game to play or on what toys to play with, ang dami pala namin things in common pa rin pala. Na, ah, okay, magkapatid pala talaga kami. <laughs> like, kahit yung pag-uugali minsan, yung parang, oh, you're so annoying, that's so me, stop it. <laughs> like, <laughs> oh, but, I'm, I'm, I'm blessed, I grew up with Arjo. Super. It was really just the two of us kasi. I mean, Jella and Xavi came later on in life. Oh. Diba? Closer so, kayo sa age eh. Mm-mm. So, lahat ng pinagdaanan namin, we went through it with each other. Every all the drama of our family, of my parents, lahat yan, together lang talaga kami. Alam mo yun, sobrang, we were all each other had. Ano yeah. siya? Protective brother ba siya? Like sa mga manliligaw, ganyan? Does he have a say? Ha. Hindi kasi kami na, nangingi alam sa love lives ng isa't isa. We only discuss when we need advice. Kasi alam kong pag ikwento ko na kay Arjo, totoo na yun. Yun na yun eh. Oo. Yung parang... Seryoso. Kasi ah. his opinion matters to me so much na parang the trivial details I try not to tell him because kunwari na irita ako, kunwari this is guy I'm dating na parang oh, stressing me out. Di ko na sinasabi yun kay Arjo kasi I don't want him to disapprove ultimately. Di ba? Oo. So we, 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 uh, he strict Hmm. Minsan, pag damit ko, masyadong maikli, mahilig kasi mag short sa bahay. You're gonna be like, you're gonna go out like that? Your shorts are so short. I can see your butt. Mga oh my gosh! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Ganun, ganun conservative lang. kuya! Oh Arjo is so conservative. Arjo is super traditional. Like, panliligaw, uh, pananamit. Well, at least for me. Well, he doesn't impose it naman. Ah. He doesn't he doesn't like, di naman ako pinagbabawal. Right. Pero pagsasabihan ako, ganun. Uh-huh. Ganun naman siya eh. It's like, I'll tell you if there's something wrong. If you take it, it's up to you. We're more like, okay, I'm gonna be here for you. I'm gonna support you. Go ahead and make your own mistakes. I'm here lang. Ganun kami. Mm-hmm. Hindi kami, alam mo yun, ayaw namin, man, if anything, ako yung mas parang, I don't like her. Like, sa mga exes niya before, like, high school, I'd be like, parang, are you sure? Ganon. <laughs> Ako yung mas parang, why? Like, yeah, I love our job. I love him so much. Ano pa yun niya about love life na Oo, pag, ano, favorite mo? He knows. Okay, kami ni Arjo, very, 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 ano kami. When it comes to love life, very. As in, ha, give you all my love. Ganon. Uh, Ganun ka man. He knows that about me. So, I think, above all things, what really struck me with Arjo, as of late, ah, yung pinaka sinabi niya sa akin na tumatak is, okay lang, go do what you want, as long as you have the, you have the upper hand and you leave some for yourself. Yun. Fair. Yeah. In the same yeah. way, ikaw sa kanya, very, ano, no, protective. Parang ikaw nga din yung kapag, ano, talaga, Nako, hindi pa pwedeng hindi ako magsalita or pagka nakikita mo na, feel mo na ang kabiyad or whatever. Okay. It's, honestly, that's really just how I am with everybody. <laughs> like, um, I'm, I never acknowledged it until people always tell me, girl, you're so frank. I'm always like, what? No, I'm not. They're always like, no, you are. Ganon. Minsan nga parang, am I being so self-righteous? Like, is there something wrong with me? Hindi eh, pero parang, I mean, I only speak out naman when I feel like I have to. Hindi ko mataes. Kung wala, kung mayroon akong ayaw talaga, sasabihin ko sa'yo na parang, uy, ayoko yung ginawa mo sa akin ha. Ano yun, dadedmahin mo lang ako. Alam mo yung ganun? Mm. Like, ayoko kasi na, I don't, I don't like negative energy. And I know that when I offend, so, well, I know that if somebody offends me, that's gonna be negative energy in my part. And I have to tell you, you need to know na parang, yo, I'm offended by this. Although, you know, it takes a lot also for me, like, I, a lot of debates with myself na, okay, sasabihin ko ba? Okay, hindi ko ba sasabihin? 
But yes. So that's why with Arjo, he's always like, Actually, you interview nga namin lately for Rice and Shine. You're a Rice artist. Ah. Uh-uh. Jai Ho. Doon yan nabanggit. At doon ko din na-realize na ayaw, o nga, no? O nga, tama. Parang sabi ni Arjo, Rhea really just says what she thinks. Sometimes, I don't even believe what she says. Parang yung parang, sometimes she says things. <laughs> na yung parang, some, yung, yung parang, I get so emotional. Na hindi niya, <laughs> may, hindi naman sa hindi niya pinaniniwalaan. Yung parang, okay, hinahayaan lang niya ako. Okay. And then, pag mag-uusap na ulit kami ng maayos, sa kanya akong kakausapin ng maayos. Alam mo yun? Ah, yeah. Oh, yes. Mm-hmm. Okay. Parang, we Very just have to understand. Ka, when you have, yung parang something you believe in, talagang, you'll stand by it. Yeah, yeah, ano mo. Eh, kaya nga, ang dami kong post, di ba? Na parang, uh, di ba? Sobrang, <laughs> napapagalitan ako doon minsan ng mga taong in my paligid na parang, mm, yeah. Pero yung ano, at napapanindigan nyo naman. Yun naman ang yeah. halaga doon eh. Mm-mm. Napanindigan Ayun naman. Ayun yun. Off comments lang from others kasi, again, if I read their opinions, it will somehow, as much as I don't want to, it will still affect my mental and emotional state. So again, only open to those who matter to me. Ganon. Keb, sa mga hindi. Yeah. Okay. Pero yung mga, okay, like, pero like, kunwari, yung fans ko na I don't follow back sa Instagram ko, I have naman a private Instagram for my fans. Doon ako nag-share na pwede sila mag-comment. Oh. Really? Just for my fans. Kasi wala akong friends doon. Hindi ko in-invite friends ko. Ginagawa ko yun kasi sometimes, di ba, parang I go on hiatus sa social media. Or sometimes, like, means, natripan ko yun eh, nung parang medyo malala yung bashing sa akin. Pero kaya lang naman. Parang, okay, teka, detach muna ako. Pero parang unfair naman to the people who support me, di ba? Na parang, I'll take away, I mean, I not for anything, not na, not an artista complex or whatever, I feel like I'm also here because of them. And not that I owe them anything, pero I feel like, I still want them to see na, okay, you guys, your support matters to me. As much as I'm detached from the world, I want you to see that I'm okay and your support is keeping me going. Ganon. So, mm-hmm. I do have a private Instagram for my fanage. Ang galing. At least may connect pa rin. Oh, oh. Mahalaga din naman oh. yun, syempre. Oo. Oh, oh. At yeah. ito na, oh. lockdown, di ba? Pero kahit na lockdown, syempre, hindi, sa iba, hindi naman yan hindrance para magkaroon ng love life or whatever. So, ikaw ba ay may love life kahit quarantine? Paano? <laughs> di ako si Joseph Marco. Hi, <laughs> Joseph. I am, I am so happy for Joseph. Correct, love life. Oh. In, fairness, in fairness naman kasi ako, all the people I've dated have come from being friends. Mm. Yung parang, hindi ko, hindi ko alam. Doon yung nagiging, I, hindi ako comfortable then I think. As hard as it is to cross that line ng friendship. Kasi once you cross it, parang, oh no. What now? We can't go back to being friends anymore. Me. Parang for me, I'm more comfortable that way. Kasi I don't have to pretend. Wala nang best put forward kind of thing. Correct. There's no more. Alam mo, yung kilala mo na ako eh. This is me. And if you like me because of how I am, and then I like you because of how you are too. Diba? Correct. High level of trust. So, sa ngayon, oh. single ka, Ria. Yan naman. Civil status ano? single, hello. <laughs> Civil status pero as, single. <laughs> pero, as, pero yung pagiging single, siguro ano yung pinaka na-enjoy mo rin naman? Kasi iba din yung um, advantage eh, kapag ka, alam mo yun, single ka. Ikaw, ano yung mga natutunan mo na pwede mong ma-share sa ating tepsters? Oo, kasi maraming oh. tepsters sa single ha, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> okay lang yan. Walang problema sa pagiging single, honestly. I'm 28. I feel like 28 is the prime age to have children. That's the only thing I'm worrying about. Children. Kasi genetically and science, biologically, parang I, I read so many articles na 28 is prime age for women to have a child. So, oh my God, 28 na ako. Paano ko? You know what I mean? Yun lang yung mas worry ko. But anyway, being single is fun. You get to know more about yourself. 
You don't really have to worry about other people. You get to give your time to whoever wants your time. You get to give your time to whoever you want to give your time to. Hindi mo kailangan magpaalam. Hindi mo kailangan. <laughs> Alam mo yan, yung kaya mong gawin, yung gusto mong gawin without having to think of what another person thinks about it. I and I think that's really, I think I, that's really what I love about being single. But that's also coming from a relationship that wasn't entirely perfect. Na medyo sakal, medyo young love, medyo mm-hmm. controlling. Alam mo yun, parang oh. I'm able to figure out things about myself then. I mean, of course, if you're in a relationship, you figure things out about yourself as well. Pero iba din kasi figuring out individual happiness. Parang, okay, I have this favorite book by Shel Silverstein. I'm gonna get it. Wait lang, pakita ko oh. sa inyo. Ay, ayan. Okay lang ka natin yan. May palibro. Ano, ano pink she? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Nakarelate pala. Teka ha. It's called, well, dalawa, two parts siya. Um, so there is this one called The Missing Piece. Ang bongga ng libro, parang hardbound. Ay. The, the Missing mi- Piece. Yes. The Missing Piece, okay. And The Missing Piece Meets the Big O. Ano yan? Pero ang grabe, nakaka, ano ah, nakaka... Alam mo, ang ganda niya, sobrang simple lang. Yung parang like, kunwari, The Missing Piece Meets the Big O. Yung pinilit ng Missing Piece, okay. pinipilit ng Missing Piece to enter or to to mingle with yung buo. Okay. Yung, hindi, na, yung whoever comes along. And then yung ending niya, basically, isa-spoil ko na, hindi nyo rin naman na. Ano. <laughs> Ito, ayan. So there's a Big O na buo. And basically, what the Big O does is, it teaches it na from being a missing piece, asan na ba yan? You can become your own circle. Yun on. Uh, parang ganun. I, I, I believe kasi that if you're gonna be in a relationship with someone, you can't depend your happiness on them. And I, I'm still... When ba did I break up? 2017, three years. Parang, you know, there's still a lot of things that needs to be... Parang every... How do you go? How do you say this? For you to be happy in a relationship, you have to be happy on your own. And I think na yung happy on my own part is still something I continuously work on. Because I struggle with a lot of insecurities as much as I seem like a strong person. So parang yun, this is a good reminder na parang you have to stand on your own eh. And right. I feel like until I know for a fact na I can stand on my own, I cannot be completely happy in a relationship because I'd be dependent. Anyway, I, mean, I want to be happy because I'm happy. I right. don't want to be happy because somebody else is happy. Correct. Hindi naman totoo yung you complete me. Wow, may ganun. Di ba parang you should be complete me. on your own. Di ba? Yes, no. It's hindi siya half plus half equals one. Alam mo yung we are one. Hindi kayo one. You guys are two. Two complete <laughs> individuals. Come on. Yeah, tama, <laughs> tama. <laughs> Grabe, Let's... no? Sabi natin natutunan. Correct! Oo, oh, oh, may pamising piece pa. Bongga yun, ha? Uy, oh, yun. Kung maganda Ganda, siya, ganda. Ay, na, gusto ko yan. Eh, magugusto ng friends natin yan. Oh, oh, Pero, oh. single din. Uy, oh, pero oh, ano, oh, Ria, oh, oh. non-negotiable, may ano yung showbiz or non-showbiz? May ganun ka bang ano na dapat hindi non-show, ay hindi showbiz yung maging boyfriend or if ever man the next time around? Wala. Whoever comes, whoever will treat me right. Mm-hmm. So, ganun Ayun lang. Naman. Open lang to ano, basta... Ganun lang. Basta maayos yung trato sa akin. And, siguro yung negotiable, non-negotiable ko pala. Now I realize, kailangan okay sa family ko yung, yung, hindi na, like, mingles with my family. Such a big deal. Alam niyo, mas sobrang close kami, di ba? Yun nga. Uh-huh. So, it really matters. Mm-mm. Parang yung gusto ko, parang, okay, get to know my family also. Because they're such a big part of me. My cousins, oh my God. Super big part of me. Ang super close kayo talaga as a family. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Pati yeah. relative. Mm-hmm. So, ayun, I guess that's it. It's family. 
Yeah. Bongga ta si Ria. Yes, di ba? Yeah. Oye, mga natutunan natin kay Miss Ria at I din ngayon. Pets. Hello! Diba? From ano, from chica best to ano, usapang ano na, single and pep talk, ganyan. Hello! Hindi, pero sorry mo siya. Kung single kayo, huwag kayong maano. Mahilig ako maghugot, ha, as a person. As in, ay, buti pa siya, hindi iniiwan. Yung mga ganon. Uh-oh. Pero parang, yung parang nasanay lang ako kasi ganun kaming lahat sa work before. Pero, it's, there's some, it's just a matter of figuring yourself out. Don't, don't beat yourself up for being single, regardless of how old you are. Because it'll come. Everything in good timing. Just have faith that it'll come. Alam mo yun? Yay! Okay. Ano, noted na yan, talaga. Sorry. Very good. Very good. <laughs> oh, ito, pasay- pasayahin natin, na Ang okay. ano, sabat. kasi ano Ria, dahil first time mo dito sa PEP, in, in, in all our formats talaga, may ganito. Hindi, ito na It's ako. now time for our PEP! Challenge! challenge! Okay, game. Okay, so ang challenge na ito ay tinatawag natin Chris in Five. Actually, matagal na tong challenge, pero dati kasi medyo ano lang siya, parang fun lang and yung parang ano lang, laro-laro lang. Ito, parang getting to know you more. Ganon yung aming ano. So, bali, five questions ito, pero merong Pero per question, magbibigay ka ng tatlong sagot. So, may mga okay. katanungan, sitwasyon na, ano. So, magbibigay okay. ka ng nating answers and kung gusto mo i-explain o i-justify, libre ng libre naman yun. So, okay. game, Ria? Game. Okay, first question sa ating Chris in Five. Idiretso na natin. Tatlong boys na gusto mo makastock sa island. Ay! Kim Suyun. Okay. Park Seo Joon. Oh my God, Park Seo Joon. Kailangan ba romantic or pwedeng tropa-tropa? Pwede naman. Basta Kaya ano? Basta ano? boys. Basta boy. Eh, the brother ko. Ha? Ay, okay. fairness ha. Okay. Very okay. safe ka dyan ha. <laughs> <laughs> Hindi, kasi I'd, Arjun and I would have so much fun together. Mm-hmm. Ako ng island. Oh my God. I can't even... Oh my God. The amount of fun we'd have. <laughs> so, yung mga Ayan. stars na sinabi mo, obviously, dahil, ano, ikaw ay na-addict sa kanila. Itong... K-drama. Actually, si Kim Soo-yoon since 2013. Crush ko. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh my God. Si Park Soo-jo ng bago. Oo. Galing kasi nilang umarte. And they're so... I can't. Oh my God. Ano ba yan? Yung latest can't. series ba niya yan? Yung mag- ano na panood niyo ba? Oh, ganda. Oh my God! Super, hindi ako makamove on doon. Diyos ko, parang ganda. Sobra. Ano, ano yung series? It's okay. Ita- ah, okay. okay. ah, yun! Pero Itaiwan. Itaiwan kay PSG. Yeah. Maganda rin. Mm-hmm. Maganda yun. Just what's wrong with Secretary Kim? Oh my God. Oh my God. Yan, mga favorite ni Pink siya yan lahat. Eh. So, I love oh my it. Gosh. Ayan, okay. next! Next. Ah. Ito, ano... Three disturbing things about you. So, mga bagay na hindi mo type sa sarili mo, pero alam mong ganun ka. Ayun, prank ka masyado. I mean, I like it, but also, I think there's some, parang I need to learn how to choose my battles then sometimes. Hehe. <laughs> um, my jaw, siguro. I know, I only found out, parang ganun pala yung jaw ko. Ganun. Basta parang when I smile, medyo nakasight. Anyway, now that I said that people are gonna notice it. Um, <laughs> things I don't like about my insecurity. Oh, you malalim yun. <laughs> okay. Uh-huh. okay. Uh, point taken na yun. Wala nang defend, defend. Oh, oh, di na kailangan. Okay. Get na yun. Okay. And next, three shows na hindi mo makakalimutan. Three shows na hindi uh-huh. ko makakalimutan. Is Show it... Mo. Shows ko! Uh-uh. Shows, shows mo. mo. Ning Ning. Dear Heart. It's either Halik or Parasite Island. Because eh. I, I love both. Eh. Parasite. Par- siguro Parasite Island because I got... Hindi, pero close din ako sa Halik people. Hindi. Parasite. Parasite Island. 
Huwiin ko na para sa Island. Yan ang ano, number one weekend show, di ba? Oo, oh, oh, oh. sobrang hindi. Um, I think because it came at a time when, yung timing of everything. And then lahat ng nandun, as in to this day, as in ngayon lang, may message akong pumasok from Kuya Michael Flores. Ganun. Oh, yeah. Sobrang close <laughs> kami. As in sobrang kaming parang naging family. We've been to the beach together. We've traveled together to the beach. Ano ba yun? Yung... So, and then we've had ganun. so many inumats. Oo, oh, oh, parang when it goes beyond work, when you, you, and you find the family at work, yun, para sa ito. So, bonus Big na lang deal. pala na, na, ano, na number one kayo. Oo, oh, oh, naman. Kung hindi sa kantar, talagang ano, natalo niyan yung mga may hikip na kalaban. Hmm. Makakatuwa nga. Hindi eh, namin talaga inakala. As in, super, what? Talaga ba? Nakakatawa naman. Hmm. Intern sa show yeah. na iya. At saka, in fairness ba na sa'yo, Ria, ikaw ang suki sa ano, no, yung Sunday night na time slot from once Ay, wow. Parang yung once sa kaya ta din. Oo. Oh, nakakailang once din pala. Pala rin. Oo. I think I've done four or five. Ah, na series. Oh, yeah. Although, although Parasite Island is technically not one. Uh, not one it's sa. not. Okay. It's not. As much as it was the same staff. Then, but, uh, uh, pero hindi siya it's one. Not sa. one. Sa. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Pero uh, so on that note, na four ako one. Sa. <laughs> mm-hmm. Ayan. Ito na three lessons from your mother about acting and life. Always use your heart. Never be late. Respect everybody. Fairness, ah. Tumatak sa'yo talaga. Bilis mo na inisip. Oo, bilis eh. Di inisip. Hindi, tsaka, feel ko naman kasi, aside from her constantly reminding, these are things that medyo parang, come on, common sense, let's go. Alam mo yun? Like, uh-huh. yeah, especially respecting others, regardless of who they are, what they are, alam mo yun. Hello kay Miss Sylvia, nandiyan ba siya ngayon? Di ba biglang gano'n? Nasa baba, nasa baba. Mm-hmm. Nagluto yan. Ah, nagluto. <laughs> okay, oh, last. Ito na yung pang fifth sa ating threes in time. Three unforgettable moments with your brother. When I was a kid, nasa Australia kami dalawa, midnight birthday ko comes out with an unlit candle kasi bawal kami magsinde. Kasi prospero, you were like what? Six, seven. Um, so, nangprise niya ako at midnight. Kami dalawa lang. My birthday. And since then, we like all my birthdays, he's always the first to greet me. Okay, so that's one. Two. Uh, ang hirap. <laughs> Pero off the top of my head, siguro my car accident. Ah, kasi yung 2014. Before, bago pa ako mag-artista nun. Um, siguro kasi doon ko nakita na parang, oh, he cares pala about me. Kasi grabe yung galit niya. So, yun. Two. And three, ondoy. Siguro ondoy talaga. Bakit? Ano nga rin? Well, for starters, kasi takot na takot kami. Yung nanay ko kasi, tagaano kami dati sa may Evergotesco area. Ortigas. Kainta Extension. Kineso. It's Pasig pa rin eh, pero parang towards Kainta Extension na. Ang layo nun from Corinthian Gardens, di ba? And my grandparents used to live in Corinthian Gardens. So, ang sabi ng mom ko nung bumabag yun na, you guys, mga anak, huwag kayong matakot. Basta kung magkawalaan tayo, mag-swimming kayo papuntang Corinthians. Oh my God! <laughs> so kami, parang, Oh my God! Is the whole Philippines underwater? Like, is this the end of our lives? Are we gonna die? So kami ni Arjo, okay, I won't ever forget. Naka-emergency light kaming dalawa. Tapos marami ako. Ayun, filler notebooks. Alam mo yun? Uh, yung, 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 yes, yung may yes, napit yeah. lang. Yun. Uh, the college. Oo. So, uh, 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 nag-isa kami. Lahat ng kaibigan namin. Lahat ng pinsan namin. Sinusulatan namin. Oh, Nag-iiyakan oh kami. Mag yung susulat. Tapos, no, Sorry, ano, bas, oo, oh, oh, kasi nga, sabihin pa naman ng nanay mo, galing kang kainta extension, mag-swimming lang kayong pamuntang Corinthians, doon tayo magkita-kita. Oh my God, ba diba? So, nung gabi yan, perma-perma kami, ganyan. And then the next day, nung naka-escape na kami, grabe yung escape, naka-alis ng bahay. Ano oh. ba? 
whatever the word is, nagano kami, naglalakad kami. Si Arjo kasi takot yun sa, ano, sa sea creatures. Mm. Ganyan. Sa eel, ganyan. Parang, feeling kasi niya, first of all, you can't breathe in water. Second, they're so powerful. So, feeling niya wala siyang kalaban-laban. I hate niya yun. Yung parang feeling niya powerless siya. So, naglalakad kami sa baha. First, swimming, 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 ganyan. Siguro mga two hours din kami, or an hour kami nag-swimming Wait, palabas. Uy, you're happy swimming! Nag-swimming ah, talaga kayo? Oo, oh, 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 malala oh. talaga. Kasi, ba- I mean, hindi nga. our village name was Riverside Village. Okay, yung so hindi river. talaga siya biro. Oh, oh. Oh, yung river oh, nasa, nasa 11th Street lang. Te- 9th Street kami. Oh my God! So yung tubig, ma- as in, yung buong first floor namin wiped out. Wala. So anyway, naglalakad kami ni Arjo already dun sa lakad part. Napigtas yung, tama ba yun? Napigtas yung uh-huh. chinelas? Oo, uh-huh, napigtas. So siya parang, eh nararamdaman yung may parang, kasi fiesta din nun sa amin, sa Pasig Air, dun sa village na yun. So parang may mga banners, may mga streamers. So yung parang, yung parang string, string. dumadaan sa paa niya, akala niya kung ano, tapos siya nagpapakas, <laughs> re, 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 get my slipper, can you fix my slipper? Gano'n. <laughs> Yung parang, oh my god. Sobrang, it was such a heavy experience, but we had so much fun. Alam mo yun, yung parang, looking back now, it's laughable. Right, so, yeah, oh my god. Hindi ko ma-imagine yung nag-swimming niya. Oh my god. Can I just share, okay? Yung village namin nun, may factory ng parang noodles or something. Okay. Or, I don't know. Basta, ang daming grasa. So, yung suot ko na parang may white line and may yellow line, naging black lahat. As in, nagtetano shot kami as soon as we got to our grandparents' house. Sinundu nila kami dun sa may flood. The way, as in, I remember when I saw our family, grabe yung iyak namin. Oh my God. We made it. Anyway, yun. Oh my gosh. Super memorable nga. Talagang legit. Legit oh, oh. memorable. Grabe. <laughs> And dami, and with Arjo, I have so many talaga. We've also gone on so many trips together. Alam mo yan? Oh, hello and, din kay Arjo. Paano kaya ako? Nakita niyo ba? Dumaan siya. Ito na yun. Kay Arjo. Kay Arjo. Hindi niya, hindi niya kayo marinig, but he's here. Correct. Pero bang uh, sa akin sa usapan. Ano, version naman nga yung ano, kung siya yung nagkwento ng kwento mo, no? Parang paano kaya? Uh, pareho lang din siguro. Kasi alam naman niya eh. Tsaka, Pero alam mo na, na yun, na imagine ko yung nasa tubig ka. Kaya, <laughs> Arzo. Ay, na-imagine ko yung nasa tubig at matakot ka sa... Oo. Oh, oh. Kung may... Kung may... Kung may something na uod or ano. Oo. Oh, oh. I was making that about Ondoy kasi. Oh. They were asking me, what are my top three most memorable experiences done with you? Sabi ko, um, when it was my birthday in Australia, you surprised me with a candle. My car accident when you got mad and on doy. Oh my god. Yes, and you were like, oh my god, get it, get it. <laughs> Grabe. But of course, I had to defend it. Leg-leg ka niya. Hindi, I, takot talaga yun sa tubig. I needed help. I, there might be a shark. Oh, see? Correct. <laughs> Pero nakakatakot nga yun, no? Yeah. Ay, ako, Diyos ko. Tubig ka. Of course, pa naglangoy dun sa ano, baka. Grabe, alam mo, yung village namin, yung bahay namin dun, five minutes away lang from the gate. Pero dahil sa tubig, ito kasi about an hour and a half to two hours. Ah, oh my gosh, para ilangoy yan. Oo, Diyos ko. Baka langoy ah, kasi yung, parang yung boat na nakuha, boat, by the way, yung dingy, yung, basta may boat na nakuha, na, pump boat for my mom, who was pregnant with Shavi then. Jella, who was nine years old. And my Lola, my mom's mom. So, sila lang nasa boat. Kami kumakapit. Kaso, ang nangyari, yung boat, hindi kaya yung current. So, they had to find another way. Eh kami, hindi naman namin kaya yung other way because we don't have the power. So, dun kami sa may current sumasama. Oh my goodness. Oh my God, hindi ko ma-imagine yung may current dahil oo, kapalatabi ng river, no? Just ko, Lord. Ibang so, level yung ginawa niyo. Iba. Wow, wow talaga. And then after that, lumipat muna kami ng condo for a year. Then muna kami nag-stay. Then we had this um, house now where we stay built agad because traumatizing talaga. 
To this mm-hmm. day, parang pag-uhuulan kami, parang okay, is it gonna flood? Alam mo yun? Malala. Kaya parang ang taas ng ano din ng bahay nyo ngayon. Oo. Yung okay. parang, yun naman yung, pero nasa may fault line kami, so parang okay. From, from a flooding <laughs> area, you are now in a fault line, pumili ka ng disaster. Come on. Huwag naman sana, ano. Pero ngayon na-imagine ko na na si Miss Sylvia, kaya pala ganun yung reminder niya, yung paano niya sa inyo na mag, mag-swimming na lang kung saka-saka. Oh, Dahil sa totoo, it's legit. Oo. Oh, oh. Nakakatakot. Ang lalim. Oh my yes. God. Ha. <laughs> <laughs> Yun na lang yung nasabi, ha. Pero ano, di ba? Memorable talaga. Imagine mo, 11 years ago. Oh sa pagtagumpay yan. Ano yun? Oo. Oh, oh. 2009 eh, di ba? 2009. Oh, 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 oh. oh my God, so Jada was only seven. Sorry, she was sometimes. She was seven. Grabe. Grabe. Grabe yun. Mm-hmm. In fairness. No, ang dami nating, ano ah, napulod dito kay Ria na mga from okay. mga heart, ano, advice pati sa mga adventures with Arjo. Kaloka. <laughs> Bongga. <laughs> Perfect na ano pala, pang last question sa ating ano. Correct nga! Di oh, fairness. Hindi <laughs> ko na maisip. Ayan. Ano ko din kasing memories. So, yun na lang. Mm-hmm. So, um, Ria, siguro ano na lang yung mga ano, mga nililook forward mo for 2020, yung remaining ng 2020. And lalo na ngayon may mga bago kang mga opportunities Projects na ano dumating na. sa'yo. Sana makapag Pasko tayo with their families. Yun talaga. That's all I'm hoping for. Mm-hmm. Kasi sobrang, it's been so hard not seeing them. Yun, that. That's what I'm saying. Ah, kasi yung mga relatives. Mm, so, mga ganyan. Mga ganyan. Mga ganyan. Magkakasama magpipinsan with their lolo, with their lola. So, parang, it's that talaga. Yun. Pero, of course, work. Like, um, more days would uh, Chica Besh. Chica Besh. I'm hoping I get more acting stuff as well. Kasi kaya namang gawa ng paraan if ever. I miss acting. At saka before, ano, Chica Besh, di ba nakapag-guest ka pa sa show ni Juday? Oo, oo. Mm-hmm. Paano ka nakapasasa lang? Ayun Congratulations, Ria. Thank you, guys. Ha? Thank you for having me. Sorry, ang dami ko pa lang nakwento. Parang, okay lang yun, no? Overload. Ano ba? Yung masaya, di ba? Oh, correct. Yun naman ang ating ano ay chika-chika, ganyan. Chika-besh o bumagay. Ayan. Thank you so much, Ria. Saan ka pwedeng i-follow ng Pepsters and ibang mga viewers natin, Ria? Okay. Please don't forget to watch Chika-besh. Every morning, 10 a.m. on TV5 and 11 a.m. on Colors. And if you want to follow me, that's at Ria on Instagram and at Ria Atayde on Twitter. Ayun naman. Thank you, Ria. At syempre, huwag niyo rin kakalimutang i-follow ang PEP sa aming social media accounts on Facebook, facebook.com slash Pep Alerts, Instagram and Twitter at Pep Alerts din. Sa Viber, meron tayong Viber community chat. Hanapin niyo lang, pep.com ph tas yun na yun. Tas, sa loob noon, merong Viber chatbot na pwede kayo maglaro ng games, ng mga pa-quiz, ganyan. At saka, pwede na kayong dumiretso mismo sa www.pep.ph using that Viber chatbot. And meron din kaming Kumo account, pep.ph. Huwag niyo kakalimutan i-follow. Yes. And Tuesdays and Thursdays, Pep Live, 8 p.m. Yes. Yay! Thank you, Ria! Thank you, thank you. 